Happy Monday, friends. I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Alita Loresco with a look at your one minute weather. If you enjoyed the warm weather on Sunday, you'll be able to enjoy a couple more days of warm weather before a cold front arrives and brings back the cooler weather. Today, the rain chances are close to zero, less than a 20% chance you'll encounter any sort of rain. Those rain chances slowly go up for Tuesday, but overnight Tuesday into Wednesday morning is when those rain chances will peak up to 70% before dropping off. We're going to be monitoring a front pushing through the area that is going to send the rain chances up, but also increase our flood risk for Tuesday, beginning during the afternoon into the evening hours and then slowly sliding eastward into uh, Louisiana as we get into the Wednesday timeframe as that cold front pushes through uh, much of southeast Texas. We'll see a flood risk between five to 10%. Right now, rainfall totals look like uh, anywhere between one to two inches. The severe weather threat also go up, goes up on Tuesday, especially as we get into the afternoon and evening hours as that frontal system makes its way a little bit closer toward uh, southeast Texas. And then the severe weather threat does shift further to the east as we get into Wednesday morning, Wednesday afternoon. Here's a look at your hour by hour forecast for today. You can see temperatures warm very nicely into the low 70s. That breeze coming in out of the south southeast could deliver some gusty conditions at times, 20 to 25 mile per hour gust a possibility. But that front will be arriving overnight tonight into tomorrow morning in our far northeast counties. We're talking out toward the hill country Tuesday afternoon and then a few widely scattered showers right now. As I mentioned, only a 40% chance you'll encounter some of that wet weather it really won't be until late at night where those rain chances will be increasing around college station around the midnight hour and then uh the front should be arriving into Houston sometime around sunrise on Wednesday. So get ready for a slow ride for that morning commute. And then that's going to quickly push closer toward the coastline sometime just after lunch. And then most of the rain tapering off for the evening hours. And then we've got some nice dry conditions for you. Thursday and Friday. Uh, highest rainfall totals right now look centered uh, just to the west of I-45. We've got some great looking weather to close out the week. Could be some pa patchy frost when you get up on Thursday morning, but we do have another front that's going to deliver a uh, reinforcement shot of some colder air. So we've got a cooler weekend in store for us. Those temperatures will drop off in the low to mid 30s with highs in the 50s and 60s. And yes, Valentine's Day next Tuesday. Got some beautiful weather setting up. Slight chance for for some wet weather for now. All right, that's a look at your forecast on this Monday. Thanks for watching.